Okay, I'm back, and I promise you... Oh, looks like it's... I'm not bashing line 6, but I figure if you're going to, you know, if you've seen these mics and you've used them, I've used this one in the field quite a bit, and it has been a disappointment. But what do I love about it? Number one, it sounds incredible. Um, when the audio isn't dropping out, it sounds like you picked up a mic and it's connected to a wire. Right? The build quality is excellent. I love the profile. I love the design of it. I like the ability, if I turn it on here, to... Let's see. Interesting thing, it has like a safety feature here where you... If your fingers stray... Alright, power model. There we go. Alright. So as you see this flashing here, it is modeling a uh, 935, 41767, D5, L6, SM58, Beta 58, Beta 57, or just a SM57. Right? A whole bunch of different mics without having to change the capsule or buying an expensive capsule. You can model uh, a whole bunch of different, uh, very popular microphones or microphone capsules right here in the microphone itself. Amazing value added feature. It has encryption. You can change the name of the microphone. Some really, 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 really good features. I even like the case this thing comes in. Instead of, say, for example, Shure's pencil case, um, this has a beautiful... Um, perfectly padded nylon case that it comes comes in and I don't see where mine is gone but uh, great microphone but again if you looked at the first part of this review with the receiver 2.4 gigahertz spectrum you put this mic on one of the TV channels that are still open for use and this is an excellent excellent microphone pair uh, I showed the unidirectional antenna last. This is the omnidirectional version. Um, it also has an antenna gain selector on the back. Um, again, good design. Uh, it's fairly lightweight. It's not quite the build quality of the rest of the Line 6 uh, products. but uh, And I'm not sure how helpful it would be with uh, the audio dropout issues with this this microphone, uh, which is unfortunate because a great mic, um, you know, in places that uh, Wi-Fi isn't prevalent or Wi-Fi is on a completely different spectrum than 2.4 gigahertz, those countries would probably love this mic. Again, if this mic was retuned to um, a frequency that was less crowded, uh, the mic and receiver, brilliant device, but um, would I ever trust this on a production that was uh, professional in nature? The am answer is simply no. Which is a shame. So hopefully Line 6 uh, makes some changes for the North American market at least with this mic. And you know everything else about it is great. Just a frequency.